Hey guys, Jimbo Oven here, and today what I have for you is some more Boom Beach gameplay. Today what we're doing is going to be facing Dr. Terra Volcano Stage, um, and they're pretty much using um, pretty much heavies and zookas and also some uh, pretty much medics, uh, medics slash healers or whatever uh, you want to call them. Pretty much what happened was, guys, I just got my headquarters to level 15, so I just unlocked medics, and I pretty much got a residence and another sniper tower, so I'm upgrading those, and I'm also finally getting to play with some medics, so I haven't actually played with them, so this is like my first time ever playing with medics, so let's go ahead and try it out. Hopefully, like, the medics heal really well, really well, so that I can keep my troops alive for a very, very long time. Um, so we're just, just, let's just go ahead and get rid of this base really quickly. Um... I don't want to lose any, really any troops at the beginning of the game, so I'm, I'm kind of being really, really just tactical in terms of how I'm going to place all my stuff. Um, and then we'll send our medics right over there so that they heal the troops. So, do they walk with the troops, or what do they do? Doesn't look like they want to walk with the troops, unfortunately. Um, there they go, now they're walking with the troops. So, how much do they heal? I've never seen them heal... Let's see this. Let's see how they heal. Awesome. So they actually do really, really good healing, which is really, really nice. And they do, st uh, like, stay intact in terms of, like, how, like, where they go and everything like that with your troops. And they, they're not, like, I guess they're not really going after the guys that should be healed. But then again, they are going after pretty much the stuff that I want to be healed, uh, which is pretty good. So as you guys can see, this pretty much guy, it's really hard for him to be destroyed, which is really good. Uh, so we'll go ahead and send just some barrages, a few of them just at that. Uh, and then, yeah, that should be destroyed right over there. Send a missile in there, why not? Okay, so yeah, Dr. Terror, Dr. Terror Stage 1, very, very easy. We got some in intel and some uh, crystals, which was really awesome. So let's go ahead and attack it again. We didn't lose any troops, I don't think so. Uh, so this one a little bit trickier. We got some cannons and stuff like that that we have to get rid of. Unfortunately, so that is going to be a really annoying. Come on, destroy that. Doesn't want to destroy that, unfortunately. Uh, still good, though. So we got got rid of that, and we'll just attack that again. And there we go. We got rid of that. Perfect. Okay, so now what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to send them in over here. So let's go ahead and do that. Send them in over there, there, and then pretty much max right over there, so behind all the troops. I'm planning on pretty much my medics, so that the heal, um, let's just see what they do. Oh, they target the, pretty much the last troop in the back, and then if these troops need health, they go to the front. Okay, that's pretty good. How fast are they? They're relatively fast, not that fast, unfortunately, um, but still good. So, stun that over there. Go ahead and stun that one cannon. I'm going to have to stun it again. Uh, so, we'll go ahead and stun that really quickly one more time. I uh, want my troops to target this really quickly, just so it's destroyed, so I don't have to worry about it. Awesome, got rid of that. That is good. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pretty much put a bomb right over there, help that out. Um, and then we should be good. We got some uh, pretty much guys that are coming over here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just move them. Pretty much send all my guys over here so that they're protected and they don't need any smoke, which is really good. So yeah, now the healers just wait there. That's pretty cool, so the healers help out a lot. But probably, probably they aren't that effective at this point of the game, I would say. Um, because, like, I would rather finish the stages a little bit faster. But then when it comes to late game or whatever, oh, we got a achievement region of the Terra. I'm going to check that out really quickly before I move on to the next one. Uh, and just check if we have any troops, that, more troops that we need to train. Doesn't look like it was just clucked. And check this out, region of Terra, 80 gems. Wow, that is awesome. Um, so... Destroy Dr. Pear's bases, so we destroyed 100 of them, which is pretty cool. So we're already at 80 gems again, which is really awesome, guys. So let's go ahead and attack it again. Uh, this time, let's see what we got. We don't have that much. We got a rocket launcher right back over here. So we'll go ahead and wipe that out at the exact same time, guys. I want to go ahead and pretty much wipe out this boom cannon over here. So we should be able to just send two there. It should make it relatively low. Let me send one rocket launcher there, and... One pretty much shot right over there. That is perfect. Got most of that base out of the way. Now what I'm going to do is send in these guys and pretty much these guys and then those guys right in there at the exact same time. Pretty much when these cannons target. I'm going to go ahead and stun everything. Our healers should come and start healing them up, which is really, really good, guys. Really helpful in terms of fighting. Um, getting ready to stun this area. There's the stun and stun both of them, which is really good. 
pretty much done play right over there, so uh there we go. How much damage do these things do? I don't really know. How much can I uh, sorry, how much can my healers heal I'm at? Uh so they heal a lot. Um it's not like they heal a ton and everything like that. Uh go ahead and shield this area really quickly so that my guys don't die, don't want anything to die. So there we go, we got a few things in here, but it's still good. Uh, go ahead and put down a heal really quickly over here, just in case. It's just in case this attacks it. I doubt it will, but yeah, we're pretty good. Throw, guess I guess the smoke, whatever, got it, all the troops. So that's pretty good. Okay, so we did lose one troop, not bad. Let's go ahead and train that troop up. Um, don't really need it unless we're like unless we really really need it or whatnot. Um. Just look at this base over here. So what I'll do is I'll go ahead and send in these troops guys right here. Um, and once I do send them in, I should be able to just... I don't want to send in any troop that I will have a chance of losing or whatnot. So trying to send the troop a little bit far back over here. Just so it doesn't die or whatnot. And then I'll send in pretty much my healers over here to help them out because they do need a lot of HP. Uh, to come back in, which is really good. Um, just looking at everything right over here, so they should be turning in this way. Hopefully, yes, they are turning in this way. Throw down a heal really quickly over here. Just didn't want my troops to die over there, so it's good. Hopefully, like the healers, they start healing my zukas if they need it first, because my zukas are one of the big, one of the problems that I want to keep alive and everything like that. I don't want them to die that fast. We'll go ahead and also send in a barrage right over here to get rid of pretty much those mines at the exact same time lower this so that we can pretty much two shot it right over there and we'll go ahead and shoot something at that to lower it even more. Um, stun that area right over there. Lower that a, a lot so that our troops can go in and then we're gonna have to stun it again really quickly so throw the stun in there uh, so it's even lowered and then we got a healer here that's helping them out which is really good. Um, Hopefully it targets that troop, not... Yes, it did target that, that troop, which is really good. So we should be able to just remove this. I may just put a... Okay, just in case, going ahead and put that there. Send it heal. Okay, never mind, they don't even cross there, which is really good. Just didn't want that troop to die right there. I think we may have lost one troop, guys. No, we didn't lose any troops. That is... Okay, that is really good. Okay, so we gotta... Uh, I'll just really quickly do... Pretty much upgrade on my sniper tower, because I just pretty much did... Um. I have another sniper tower because I just did an upgrade on my headquarters, which is really good. So, let's go ahead and attack this base again, guys. Um, still a little bit tricky, but we should be able to do this. Send in a barrage at that uh, pretty much rocket launcher. And then after that, we should be able to just throw about two in, I believe. I have to throw in there. Um, looking around here, guys. So, we got this right over here. So, I think we should be able to destroy that. Um, it still has HP, but that is still fine. Uh, we'll send in, um, pretty much our troops or whatever, our Zookas and Heavies, and we'll send the healers from be on, uh, behind them or whatnot. Uh, I do need one more, pretty much a little bit more, um, Gunbone Energy. There we go. We can get rid of that defense right over there. Uh, and their troops should be, get, get we sh should be able to come in or whatnot. Um... But it's good that hopefully they don't target target that heavy. Target that heavy at least. Uh, okay, it did. Target the heavy, which is good. And now our healers should come and heal that heavy up, which is really good. There they go. They're healing it up at the exact same time. Uh, we got our troops attacking, which is really good. Um, and now what I'll do, guys, is I'll go ahead. I'm just looking around this map. We don't have anything that we have to worry about, which is really good. Um, so we can just leave our troops there. But for fun, why don't we just throw... A little barrage in there. I don't know. Just for fun. Why not? Um, and then we can leave that like that. And then what we'll do is uh, we'll go ahead and stun our troops right over here. Just for fun. <laughs> As a joke. Uh, so, yeah. I, I, like, before I never knew that you could actually stun your own troops. But then I, I was, like, going after something. I back said stun my own troops. I'm like, what? You can do that? That's pretty cool. Um, so, yeah, we got. So, what are we on now? Dr. Terror Stage 6, which is pretty cool. We got a few rocket launcher guys, so a little bit tricky. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, pretty much go on this side first. So I have to get rid of this right over here. And then this is going to take a few shots to destroy. Uh, it should take all of that. Yes, there we go. Got rid of it. Um, and then for this specific one, guys, what I'm going to do is first send them in over here at the exact same time where they're sending one of those guys. 
pretty much the rest of the guys were over here. Uh, and hopefully they, oh, they were supposed to go up there, one of them up there. Uh, but it's alright. Uh, so we want to send them over here to get this stuff. Pretty much these crates and packages or whatnot. And then after they get those crates and packages, we'll send them back over here. So let's go ahead and we may need to smoke right here or something like that uh, just to help them out. Uh, so let's just go ahead and smoke that area. Oh, we just lost that troop. Not good. Um, so then what, what I'm ex like hoping that they would do is pretty much these guys will go here exact same time. Yes, our heavies went in front. Our tanking, which is really good. And we got our healers healing, which is really, really nice. These healers, just keeping them alive a lot, which is really good. Go down a medic pack, just help them out a little bit. They have to, like, shoot that building really quickly. Lower that a little bit more. Um, just looking over here, so we don't have much to worry about. I'm going to go ahead and stun this area right over here, guys. Keep it a little bit lower. Got to keep that as low as possible. Don't have to worry about it. Uh, we do have a lot of troops coming, and we have to pretty much stun that again, guys. Make it even um, easier to get. We need to get rid of that cannon right over there. So hopefully my troops like do a turn or whatnot. Uh, we need them to get rid of that. Attack that. Attack that troops. Um, and then we'll send them back right over here, guys. Exact same time. We'll smoke this area right over here to keep them alive. Uh, hopefully, yes, medics get in that hole. Get in that hole for us. We need you alive, medics. We need you alive. Wanted my medic to go more up that way, but that is all right. Um, this is not a good raid, guys. Uh, good that the medics are at least healing. Ugh, no, it targets my medics, unfortunately. Did not want it to target my medics, guys, because I wanted... My medic could have healed this troop up with rocket launchers, which is really good. So, let's go ahead and retreat this row really quickly. Um, and then... Oh, that sucks. That really sucks, guys. We only saved one guy, so not a good raid, guys. But we did end up getting to stage 6. Remember, first time with medics, so it is a little bit tricky to use them. Have to uh, kind of, like, know how to use them or whatnot. It's good that I put that boat there, at least save one. So, lost a lot of things, but definitely, it's a, definitely raiding with medics was really fun, guys. And I'm also going to be doing some pretty much medic gameplay, because there's a lot of bases that I want to take down, but unfortunately are really difficult to just take down by themselves, because of just I have no pretty much healing on my troops so the mechs should be making should like make bases easier to take down and everything like that so I hope you guys enjoyed this little um I guess you could say walk through a little just play through of uh Dr. Terra Volcano stage if you guys did enjoy this video make sure to smack that like button and if you really enjoyed this video guys make sure to hit the subscribe button and make sure to apply to the Jim Wildcraft Network for 70% revenue share guys and make sure to click the link in the description if you want to get free gems free diamonds and all and pretty much free gift cards um in general and pretty much the free diamonds and free gems are in Boom Beach and Classic Lines if you want to get them. So just click the link in the description. And it pretty much brings you to Cash for Apps, which is pretty much a system where you pretty much uh, download apps and you get points, which you can trade in for all the stuff that I said before, the gift cards, the d diamonds in Boom Beach, and the gems in Clash of the Clans. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. This has been Jimbo Evan, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.